Um, I became a paramedic in 2015, started at Worcester University in 2013, direct entry um, foundation degree. Um, was a paramedic there for two years, then I became a one day mentor, uh, then did my five day mentor course back here at Worcester um, and now I'm a clinical team mentor um, at Dudley Hub. I was quite apprehensive at first. I was a more mature student and I'd got a family and I was, I was concerned about how I would cope being at university. Um, but, you know, the staff uh, were great. Um, I loved the time here. I really enjoyed um, the lectures, uh, far more than I thought I would, to be fair, um, and the clinical skills I enjoyed. Um, it was a great experience. Um, I would you know, recommend anybody, even in later years, to go to university. Uh, the support was always there from the team. You know, they were always happy to, to meet with me and talk me through things where I was struggling. You know, any help with any additional clinical skills I needed, you know. Uh, they went above and beyond really I felt for their students um, and that's why it made the course such a, an enjoyable course for me because there was always somebody there that I could turn to for support. The clinical skills for me, I think it has to be the clinical skills um, because as I say academic writing was, was where I struggled, where I kind of I excelled at the clinical skills and I found that a bit easier so I enjoyed all the clinical skills and the um, equipment and the facilities that Worcester have um, made it the best next thing to a patient because it's very difficult you know to, to role play and, and OSCE situations when, it, when it's not a real patient but for me Worcester had all the equipment it was the ne next best thing and the same equipment that was then on the ambulances so you became familiar with the equipment that Worcester have for when I was out on placement. It was just the best. I mean, it, it, it's a great ambulance service, West Midlands Ambulance Service, and, and that's what I think makes Worcester such a fantastic course. Not only the university is exceptional, but then when you've got your placement with West Midlands Ambulance Service, it kind of just, um, you know, makes the whole experience second to none. Um, but the mentors at West Mid's Ambulance Service are always approachable. They, they help in any way they can to assist you with the course. I love the placement. I think that's why we all do the job, you know, to, to get here and get on placement. Um, and, you know, no two, no two days the same at the Ambulance Service. So you can be dealing with, with um, a birth or a death in the same shift. And for me, the, the, there's no other job that's like that. From day one, you know, time management is a big um, factor. I always used to plan my weeks, plan even months actually, you know. Um, and being a mom, you know, I did need my time with my children, so I always used to make sure that I had that time with my children and that it was quality time with them. It's time management around your shifts and, and knowing what work you've got coming up at university and, and factor those in on your days where you're not on shift um, to make sure that you're hitting the you know the deadlines at uni as well as attending placement um, and you know it, as long as from from the word off your time management is there it's achievable for anybody you know I did it with three children